a patient with an ultra rare mutation may be the single patient in the world with that mutation. These patients uh, typically are severely ill and desperate. Our mission in, at Enlorem is to provide experimental ASO treatments for patients with ultra rare mutations and to do that for free for life. Cameron was born December 31st, 2013, and he was healthy, and there were no signs immediately. Uh, however, over of course a few weeks, we noticed he wasn't moving his arms or legs. At diagnosis, he's four weeks of age, and he's beautiful and, and healthy, except he can't move. Just three weeks later, You'll see Cameron has progressed and is already in very significant trouble, having trouble breathing. That's when we were told he had um, SMA type 1 and likely six months uh, to a year left. To meet the needs of patients with unique mutations, one needs a vastly more efficient drug discovery technology that is also more powerful. A good example it has to do with a genetic disease called spinal muscular atrophy. We were told to take him home and enjoy him, uh, but you know, there's nothing that we can do. It was very, very scary. Yeah, it's pretty much the parent's worst nightmare to hold your tiny little baby and know that it's going to die. I mean, it's just, I wouldn't wish that on anybody. And Laura Maxis is a new highly efficient, powerful technology in which we take genetic information directly and convert it to a medicine that can be personalized for each individual. What this medicine really gave us, it gave him a chance to actually be a productive member of society and live a full life. And I mean, as a father, that's all you can ask for. Today, Cameron is alive, breathing on his own, and going to school and walking with aid. To the world, Cameron represented hope to so many because there was finally something out there that could potentially save the lives of so many children. We're just so thankful and happy that this technology that Enlorem is able to provide is gonna be offered to other families. I don't have a big dream. I have a little dream to help one patient and one family at a time. And I think that if we do that, we will change the world and for the better.